beautiful friends, Sanita, Sanita, Yarnita, back here for an update of Couch Chronicles, shall we say? It's been a long, super long, like very long week, but I managed to complete one object. Thank you for coming by, showing me some love and support, giving me thumbs, commenting on my videos. Let me tell you what I've been up to. Ready? I had an idea, I think a few episodes back, starting in the month of December, I wanted to make one blue hat a week for Hat Night Hate 2023. Round of hats, and I did do that. That was the one item I completed. And now that I'm looking at the calendar, the second was the first Friday of the month, and there's five Fridays for the month of December. So I'm gonna include that in. Here's my first hat that I finished. went live to start making this hat I started with the crown of the hat and then I got to the second row of the half double crochets and then I finished the body of the hat which is bean stitches with the chain one I skipped one and then I kept going all the way around until I got to what I consider the brim, which is about two inches um, of the bottom of the hat. It's not perfect, but it's done. And I did buy some uh, tags to put on these so that I know that they're the hats for 2023. 2023. I can't believe 2022 is practically over. Anyway, so here's the hat. I'm going to try it on because remember, every hat you make, try it on yourself. And if it fits you, it will fit a child. So this one's a little bit big. And I like to wear my beanies so that the burst is bright at the back of your head which I'm going to turn around and show you there it is I hope it's in view what do you think so that's my finished object of the week but I went live to start it to show you guys how I make the uh, the crown of the hats, the beanies. And then Friday, I went live super late, like 10.30, no, 10 o'clock my time um, to pick the winner for the bobbin giveaway, which is now over. And if you haven't caught it, the winner, please check out my last live. It should be the first by 10 minutes of the live. So I hope that that person that won you know who you are if you watched it. Um, contacts me with their mailing info before Monday. So that I can get that shipped out to you. If not, you, my friend, I'm sorry, have forfeited your prize. Last night, which was Friday, today's Saturday, um, December 10th to be exact, I... Um, I gave away two other prizes. Friday, I initially started making a hat. 
another burst of kindness beanie which I finished now this is in the color colonial blue and it is a hundred and seventy yards so I can get pretty much a complete hat and I'll probably use the bean stitch again but instead of the chain one I'm gonna do a single crochet but in the meantime I got a lot of happy mail and thank you for everyone that gave me a happy mail I do appreciate now this was from uh, a winning that I did for the raffle uh, for Jax and Mama Swift and it is super big so big that I don't think I could show you it all in screen it is like it's still going it is definitely taller than me but no worries I'm gonna use this bad boy as a blanket it's a it's a a shanklet it's like a shawl blanket I love this thing and it's super warm so when I'm sitting here crocheting I can watch some TV and stay super warm and I'm always cold so I love this thing thank you Jack you did awesome and nobody can have it anyway thank you thank you Jax and she also gave me a little of a, a sticker I love this sticker it's so cute it's got a blue hat anyway that wasn't all I got I got happy mail that was sitting on my porch so should I open it now I should say it's squirrel and squirrel mail can you figure out who it's from when I say that so these goodies are from Granny D, Knit Pearl and Squirrel with Granny D Thompson. I love that lady. Anyway, it's quite hefty. I already pulled out. Ooh, what is this? She gave me referrals. So fancy. What size is it? I can't see, it's so dark. What does that say? I need the light. It's a 6.0. So I got a, a furls hook. Very fancy. I also got some more faucet in blue now advice for faucet because I've learned my lesson work from the outside but this is in the color lapis and it's super 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 soft so you know what I'm gonna put this to the side here because I will be making a burst of kindness beanie with this what else do I got Ooh, this is very very nice Look at the colors on that. This is mesmerizing. A plush sock fingering from Yarnable. Very nice. Yarnable.net. This is Granny's bougie yarn collection. I'm excited for this. There's some more in here. There's another faucet in the color lapis. I might double these up because it says it's a four weight, but it's a really thin four weight. But if you hold two together, it'll look amazing. This is going to be my next hit. Thank you, Granny. What else we got in here? Oh, here's a card. <laughs> look at the squirrel. How cute. Thank you so much for your love and support, not only for me, but for so many others. I love your kindness and loving spirit, and you're just so darn cute. <laughs> That's so nice. 
Love you, Granny D. That Granny D, she's such a stinker. There's actually three of the um, lapis faucet yarn. And this, I know the video cut off, but I'm going to put it right there. So that everybody knows that I got something from Granny. She's so cute. But I need to find tape first. So you're going to go on the wall. Thank you, Granny. This will be my next hat after I finish that one with the faucet. And since your favorite stitch is a moss stitch, guess what stitch I'm going to use for these. So thank you so much, Granny D. I appreciate it all. Now I did get um, an acquisition that I purchased. Remember I was telling you I was looking for yarn to work on? the all in the family blanket and I figured what better way than to honor my YouTube friends than with their own colorway created by Melissa from Crochet in Agreement so that's what came in this week too but I didn't open it yet so let's open it this is gonna be a happy meal video right cuz I'm so happy I also got a stitch marker. How cute is that? It's purple. And here's her info. If you want your own colorway, if you see what you like, I should put on here a neighbor alert because you are going to love everything. Now, I ventured off to get a little bit more finer, expensive yarn. Honestly, it's still. It's a little bit more expensive than what I normally purchase from her, but it's still cheaper than most yarns that I have purchased. Just saying. So I purchased... Do you know what colors I got for this blanket? That we will be making next year as a group. Or maybe I'll start making it now. Now, I have to get... December is hat month. I'm going to work on getting five hats done for the month of December. So I might have to crochet up some hats faster than the month so I can start this blanket. I'm not making any promises. Tell me if you can figure it out. Whose color is what? I think this one is Classy Kim's. This one's Karen's. This one is Tank's. And this one looks like my colorway and then we have Ola Joe's uh, Sharon's hugs are free granny um be sweet don't be ugly set us have a blessed day and the last one I got was Z's Z's um, Yarn is life. That's the name of them. So all of them except for Tank's colorway is super wash merino wool worsted. I have yarn is life with this which is Z's Peace My Yarny Fellow which is Classy Kim's and be sweet, don't be ugly, Granny D. Have a blessed day, which is um, Seta's colorway. Sharon's hugs are free, which was a collab that I believe Jax created in honor of Sharon. Deep Sea by Ola Jo. Late to the Party, which is Tank's colorway. I love to crochet. And then I have Karen the Yarn Addict collection. Because she has two actually. Which is one that my colorway was inspired by. But the color that I purchased was Keep Coming Back. And I really love that with the speckles. And then the last one, of course, was mine, Chronicles Unite. And that is basically mine and Sandrine's favorite colors. 
united together because we do bed and couch chronicles but that's it for right now i'm gonna work on this hat i'm gonna try it with my uh new furls hook that i was gifted from granny d and it's so pretty i love the black and white and so i'm gonna work on this and i see that there's a new season of firefly lane which i enjoyed the first season so i'm gonna catch up on that i hope you guys all have a great weekend check out my playlist small doses of me and thank you for your time have a great day grateful for every second of every day you get to spend with the people you love. Life goes by so quickly and life is very precious. <laughs>